Gemini, hi. This is the reading for the month of November of 2020. Uh, starting uh, Gemini for you, I have been feeling that um, you are so stressed. I don't know why, but uh, you are so stressed. Probably it has to do something with job, something in your work environment. Um, uh, maybe you, you have heard, you have found out news about your career or even your life. I think that I was feeling that you're having something like small bags into your mind all the time, all the time that uh, such little problems need closure, you know. Um, after, after this, as the time is passing, you'll start feeling a renewal inside you, around you. You'd also like to um, move things here and there into your home. And uh, um, I think that you also find you know, like from your spouse, you'll have help financially or profit from a new job. Could be also a new job that maybe that's why you had been worrying the first uh, days of November about maybe about a new job. For those that um, are not working right now, it's a very, very good time that they will find a new job now during this month. And uh, I'm feeling that uh, you will be also having um, a great support from a secret source okay so let's start the tarot reading for you gemini so let's see for okay i accept it let's see for gemini As you will see, the, uh, the month is progressing. You will see things changing for the much, much, much better. So you don't have to be stressed as you are right now. Okay. So let's see for Gemini for the month of November 2020. Gemini. So at the center of the reading, you are having the Six of Pentacles crossed by the Empress. It's your focus. You want to leave something? Situation? Job? What? In the past, you had been not knowing what to do. Maybe someone else um, made you in this position. We'll see. Let's see about the future. The Sun. So nice. Three of Cups as the energy that will support you for the rest of the month. Justice that uh, is the energy that is around you that you don't know right now. Four of Swords for your hopes or fears. And this possible outcome. Five of Cups. Bottom of the deck you have regret. Let's see about the star, we'll see about the star soon. So let's clarify, let's see about the hangman, the racing path.
not able to move. What situation made you have this not willing to sacrifice? So many of the readings, the hermit appears. This okay, the recent past. You just didn't know. You just didn't know how to move things forward into a relationship to find happiness. You know better than, than me what was this that it was so difficult for you to understand to find an idea you didn't just find the right means to uh, start a new cycle either either it's about job or love you just could not find out what to do you could not find out what to do and what did you do? Did you leave? Hmm? Let's see. Oh. Okay, I think that Gemini, you have... Um, you had quite many options. So... Uh, you thought like uh, if I cannot have an idea how to make it work and move it to the next level then I better go away because because I am so beautiful and uh, I'm so attractive and so many people around me that wanting me so you want to try your options you have been keeping your options open and this is your focus now to keep your options open but at the same time you're very loving it's not about only beautiful about uh, being sexy and um, having a lover energy no this is your um, this is the uh, your weapon let's say that to attract people coming to you and uh, check about your options for life but you have lots of love to offer and let's see about <laughs> But this, this is also hurting you. You are still hurting about this uh, relationship. Uh, you want to find the strength, how to move away from this love that you're having for this relationship in the past. You didn't know how to work things with that person or a work situation, but I think it's person relationship. Uh, you didn't know how to work, so you thought, okay, I, have, I will focus how to leave and um, see what's going on around me and exploring other options uh, with uh, your beauty, with your sexuality but inside you, you are still not over the situation you still have love for that person you really don't know how to do it you want to, you're focused but you really don't know and you want uh, it's so hard to find out a way to move away and. Uh, also detach emotionally. Let's see about the sun here. The sun or the world. King of Cups. King of Cups. Okay. Obviously, you wanted. You have already another person in your mind. You had already another person in your mind while passing this situation here and uh, you want happiness with this person and um, I think that you have to stop with one of them one of the persons uh, from the past that you have been dealing that you want to move away and another one that you are having your happiness you want to find your happiness with uh, and you will do. We have a sun with the world. Uh, amazing energies. Right? The three of cups. Let's see. With two of wands. You're waiting for the celebration. Yes. I 
I hope that you will not get involved in a three-party situation, okay? Okay, it's up to you, of course, to do whatever you want, but uh, it is a possible scenario, actually. Anyway, um, Oh yes, okay. So for the three of cups you have the ace of wands, the two of wands, <coughs> excuse me, and the page of wands. Ace of wands, two of wands, page of wands, so many ones about this celebration. I think that you already know what uh, that means. A new beginning in love, in passionate love, passionate offers maybe from two sides coming to you this month until this month okay let's say about the justice and you have to make a choice oh. energy around you the justice clarified by the fool the empress and the sun happiness having abundance making a new step uh, away from problems you have choice it will be balanced the situation that is coming is around you and you just don't know this balance the happiness the love the new start wonderful energy let's say about the four of uh, swords there at your hopes and fears it is interesting because so good energy is around you coming to you and your outcome we will see let's say about the four of swords temperance the four of swords And the page of wands. This cannot be an offer. This is a small thing that. Um, hmm. You will get so deep. You are afraid that uh, you will not be able to move. To move on in your life. With the situation that you are hoping to. If we're talking about a marriage or a long-term commitment, absolutely, you are in so difficult for you to, to make a new beginning. You first have to take your time, a lot of time that you need, so that you will start again offering just a little bit of love. And this is what you're afraid of, that you will not be able to get up and um, actually live again you want to explore but at the same time you have love for that person and you don't know how to live you want to find strength so to live and uh, leave the past situation and live your life and explore your options your future is bright the energy around you is bright the energy for this month is so good but you are also still afraid that maybe you will not move. Let's see, are you regretting later? Yes. You will regret about uh, um, two offers. You will be having two offers that maybe you will deny them. Uh, you'll have communication about two offers from two people, two people, for sure. You have one, two at least people in your life and they will um, make a, uh, the first step close to you, towards you, to me. And uh, all the best and see you next month. Thank you for watching, bye.